Hi, my name is Phil LaHaye, and I've been in the water treatment business for the last 32 years in Central Florida. Now in Central Florida, we have some pretty dirty well water, and this is the type of water that I specialized in treating. I have personally tested several thousand wells. I have personally designed several thousand well water treatment systems. I have personally installed several hundred well water treatment systems. So I speak to you from some experience. I will introduce to you a system that will solve the problems for 99% of all the well water that I've ever tested in the Central Florida area. So that system is going to be able to handle the water that you have in all likelihood. There are some exceptions. It is very important that we have from you a detailed water analysis. If you do not have one, you'll be able to communicate with us and send us a sample and we'll be able to test for most of the parameters by the mail-in sample and we'll show you how to test for the ones that we can't test for. Now I'm going to introduce you to the chlorination dechlorination system and it is a system that will handle 99 percent of all the well water I've tested. What's really important to me is that number one it's a powerful system. Number two that it is a simple system. That is, it is something that everyone can understand and can use very simple test procedures to determine how the system is doing. And number three, it must be economical not only to purchase but to maintain as well. So for my experience and from all of the systems that I have been involved in installing and maintaining over the years in very difficult conditions, I'm going to highly recommend to you the chlorination dechlorination system. This system consists of a chlorine injection pump and a diluted solution of chlorine and water. That solution is injected into the piping, which is then fed into the bottom of a retention tank, or a holding tank, or a contact tank. The chlorine solution, as it passes into the contact tank, will go from the bottom to the top, so it uses the full 120 gallons. The thing about chlorine is extremely powerful, and it will take care of iron, it'll take care of sulfur, it'll take care of bacteria, it'll take care of many situations that are common in well water applications. Once the chlorinated water has traveled from the bottom of the retention tank to the top, all of the chemical reactions that are required to purify your water to an acceptable level for consumption have taken place. That is, the iron is neutralized, the sulfur is neutralized, the odors are removed, and in some cases we can also adjust the pH. So when the, when the water comes out of the top of the contact tank or the retention tank, it will have a chlorine residual in it. A residual is the amount of free chlorine that's left after the chlorine has gone and done its work, which is to neutralize the iron and sulfur and odors and bacteria and so forth that's in the water. This is the only system that will effectively and economically treat all bacteria and and algae situations that you may find in your well water. Now I say algae and, or bacteria in some cases they're used 
interchangeably in this industry when people refer to iron bacteria. And iron bacteria or sulfur bacteria uh, is recognized as a slimy substance which grows inside your pipes and is most often recognized inside your toilet tanks. This is how you can tell if you have either iron bacteria or sulfur bacteria. The color of the slime will be brownish, sometimes reddish, and sometimes uh, a, a shade of gray, dark gray, or black. This is the only system that will handle this economically and easily. The other types of systems that will kill bacteria are ozone and hydrogen peroxide. However, it takes sophisticated measuring equipment to determine what your readings are uh, and how much uh, ozone or hydrogen peroxide you have in your system. That is why I keep coming back to chlorination system because you just simply need a pool test kit and boom, it's done and you already know what's in it. Now once the chlorinated water leaves the retention tank, it next travels to a device called a flow switch. A flow switch is simply a regulating device which turns on the chemical feed pump. So when the water is flowing into the system and through the system, the flow switch will activate the chlorination pump. So this is the way that the chlorinator pump is turned on and turned off is by sensing the flow of the water through the flow switch assembly. Once the chlorinated water passes the flow switch, the next step is the automatic carbon filter. And as the chlorinated water goes through the automatic carbon filter, all chlorine is removed, all odors are removed, all tastes are removed, all particulate matter is removed, and the water that comes out is crystal clear and is suitable literally as bottled water at that point. The next step, if you choose to do so, is to add a water softener. A water softener is a great way to get rid of the calcium and magnesium or the hardness minerals that are found in almost every water supply in this country. And when you soften your water, you will find that the white spots that were appearing on your shower doors and so forth are either totally absent or what is there wipes off very easily. Same with uh, your kitchen sink. You're going to find that your clothes come out cleaner because you, the detergents do not have to fight the hard water. And you will enjoy the feeling of the water on your skin. So, at this point, the decision is for you to look through the site, look at the pricing, and decide to get a chlorination system for your home, for your family, to clean up your water and give us the chance to help you. There's no obligation to contact us and we will assist you in this process in every way that we can. And I can assure you I've done this enough times to, to know exactly how to help you out and exactly how to explain this to you. And I think you'll appreciate all that you hear from us and all that you see from us. And if you choose our company, you will absolutely appreciate the quality of the equipment and the job it will do for you. Thank you.